welcome or welcome back to my channel if you are new to my channel don't forget to like comment and subscribe hit that post notification bell so that you get all my videos once they get uploaded and you do not miss another freaking video y'all I see it's a lot of y'all that subscribe to my channel but y'all post notification bells are not on so how are y'all gonna know when I drop another video how are y'all gonna know when I drop some more knowledge y'all not so therefore, y'all need to hit that post notification bell so that y'all will be notified every time I drop a freaking video, y'all. So let's get into this video. So I, as, you, as you guys can tell by the title, I am doing um, a at-home um, hot oil treatment. And I wanted to show you guys um, what I use in my hot oil treatment. It does promote hair growth and hair thickening. Um, I know y'all probably like, well, why you ain't got no edges, bitch? Um, because <laughs> I have a medical condition, but far as hair, baby, I have hair, um, lots of hair, lots of hair. <laughs> but, um, and as you can see, it's kind of, you know, a little thick. Um, but yeah, those who are concerned, um, not too much. I'm not too much of concern because I know how to do hair, but, um, yeah, um, my edges are pretty much, you know, thinning or gone because of my health. Um, I'm not, um, I don't have enough proteins and stuff in my body, so it's causing my hair to fall out. Um, but before, like I said, I do use my hot oil treatment because I have really bad, um, psoriasis. Um, and if you don't know what that is, it's kind of, it's a skin condition, condition, but it's also, it has something to do with hair. Um, so let me show you guys. As you can see, like, I have a lot of dandruff and stuff like that. And not always do I put oil, not never, I ain't gonna lie to y'all. I don't put oil in my hair, y'all. I don't put oil in my hair, I mean like grease in my hair, but I will put like vitamin E oil, I do put vitamin E oil in my hair to keep it moisturized. But as far as grease and stuff like that, heavy stuff, I don't put in my hair, but I do do hot oil treatments like once a month. So I'm gonna show you guys what I use in my hot oil treatments and you guys can also use it. Like I said, it do promote hair growth and also hair strengthening. So you guys can try this hot oil treatment out for yourself and see how you like it. I only do it like um, twice a month because I wash my hair a lot. But I do mine twice a month, but you don't have to do it so often. You can do it like once a month. But yeah, this is um, a combo that I use to, um, sorry y'all, I got mine blocked, to um, moisturize my hair. So let me show y'all what I use. Now, I go in with my Crisco Organic Coconut Oil. It does not have to be organic, but I prefer organic. Um, I also go in with my Extra Virgin Olive Oil. Then, I go in with my um, Castro Oil. And I just simply mix those all together. Yeah. Depending on how thick your hair is, that may be too much. No, that's enough. Depending on how thick your hair is, that's the amount that you want to use. It's, I really don't use, like, I don't measure. I just pour it in as, you know, probably like, uh, I'm probably do like two teaspoons of the oil, sorry, of the olive oil. And then I go in with my castor oil and I use one tablespoon of castor oil. Yeah, 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 yeah. Just like that, y'all. 
So just like that, and then I go in and I heat this up and I use it like that. So let me show you guys, hold on. Now I, slip, I simply just um, boil some water and then I go ahead and I will put that in there and I'm gonna just let that melt and do its thing and turn into an oil. If not, you can also um, put it in a microwave and like put it on 45 seconds or so. And you can do, also do it that way if you don't wanna do it like this way. And if you don't have a glass jar to um, melt it that way. Now, I did go ahead and I just poured my oil into this bottle because I didn't know where my, um, oh, my hair is itching. I didn't know where my, um, my other bottle was, my applicator bottle was at. As you can see, my hair is a little damped. Um, I'm gonna just go ahead and I'm gonna part it down the middle. I need my, um, my mirror. Yeah, just part it down the mirror, sorry mirror party down the middle party down the middle and it is gonna be a little warm but y'all don't want it to be burning y'all scalp so um yeah use it precautiously on your head and uh yeah you'll be fine <laughs> Now you guys are probably wondering like why do I use all them different oils specifically for my hot oil treatment um, I use those uh, me personally I use those oils because they all promote hair growth hair strengthening um, it helps with frizz also with the castor oil it's an antibacterial so it helps reduce um dandruff if you have really bad dandruff or psoriasis like something that i have it helps with the dandruff also um the coconut oil the coconut oil it helps um retain i mean yeah retain moisture and oil very quick quickly so that's why I use those um, those three specific oils for my high oil treatment. Now, like I said before, whatever works best for you, you can try it. You can try any different oils um, to see what works best for you. But me personally, these are the ones that work best for me. And I know a, a few people that use these oils and it works very good for them. So like I said, you can try it and see how it works on your hair. Now. All you're gonna do is be parting your hair and oiling it. It's just like greasing your hair. Like I said before, I don't grease my hair because it's something really heavy on my scalp. So I just always, um, twice a month, once to twice a month, do a hot oil treatment. And then I'll put vitamin E in my hair. I don't put any type of grease in my hair. oil treatment because like I stated before it does help with breakage and it also helps with split ends and then after that you're just gonna put on um, a plastic cap or a plastic bag whatever and um, you're gonna put that over your hair for like 45 minutes to an hour that's how long I keep mine on because it retains the heat so make sure that you're covering your head after um, you apply the hot oil treatment
Now, after applying the hot oil treatment, sit in for 45 minutes to an hour, however long you sit. Um, you're just going to wash your hair as normal, condition it, and blow dry it. And yeah, if you put um, grease in your hair, you can grease your hair. Like I said, me personally, I oil my hair. So after I blow dry my hair, I will go in and I'm going to oil it with my vitamin E oil. Okay, just got out the shower, blow dried my hair. Um, then I go in with my vitamin E oil because as I stated to you guys before, um, oh my nail is breaking. Like I stated to you guys before, I don't put grease in my hair. I don't put grease in my hair. Y'all, my hair feels super soft. Um, but I don't put grease in my hair. I would prefer to put vitamin E oil in my hair. It is good for um, the same thing. Conditioning, moisturizing. Um, it's, for, it's also for dry skin. So vitamin E oil does go on your skin too. And it goes on your hair. That's why I like it too. Because if the oil does happen to... Um, happens to, you know, like sweat out on my skin... Um, it's not gonna do it like really any harm because vitamin E is good for your face and your skin. So yeah, I do go in and I go and I just um, apply the vitamin E just on parts of my hair. Like, just, I mean, sorry, not on parts of my hair, but throughout my hair. And I just moisturize it like that. And then I just, um, see, do you guys see my scalp compared to how it was? It was looking so like caked up with dandruff and just so itchy but now it just feels super clean y'all and super soft and super moisturizing look my scalp is super red because like i said i do got psoriasis so it itches really bad so i'll be scratching my scalp so bad that it be having like sores in my scalp but um yeah i go in with my vitamin e and i just condition sorry just pretty much grease and moisturize and literally that's all I do when I um when I do my hot oil treatments. And um I go in because the job that I work at, I like to like um I take my wigs off, y'all. I don't wear my wigs. <clears throat> I like to um put my hair in two French braids and I'll let it just sit like that for a week until um like the weekend or until I get like dressed and then I'll throw my wig and stuff on. But other than that, my hair is like this. That's it. So I hope you, I hope I help somebody um, with a remedy that helps them with their hair. You guys go ahead and you guys can try all these products on your hair. And like I said, try this um, hot oil treatment at home on your hair. And you guys leave down in the comment section below. Or if you guys do YouTube or whatever, you guys can tag me in your reviews and tell me how y'all like it. Like how does it work for you, for your hair? Um, again, try it out for a while, like, I say like two, three months and see how your hair, um, you don't even really have to try out that much, but I'm just saying like, give it enough time to, um, see how your hair change and how it's like really moisture and how those products grow your hair and it strengthens your hair and how it leaves your hair like really moist, um, instead of so dry, especially if you have like, um, psoriasis or scalp like mine which stays dry no matter what I put on my hair. It just stays dry. Um, yeah, so thank you guys for watching this video. And let me know what kind of... Um, sorry, y'all. Let me know what kind of videos you guys would like to see on my channel. Um, and I will try to drop them for you. I do work a lot, y'all. So y'all have to bear with me like on... like. Today, I have to be work tonight that I decided to do this video for you guys. Because <laughs> I'm like, let me wash my hair and yeah, I can just get this video out for y'all. So, yeah, let me know how you guys like this. And, um, yeah. Like I said before, don't forget to like and subscribe. Hit that post notification bell so that you get all my videos once they get uploaded. And you do not miss another freaking video, y'all. 
I'm coming with these videos, these hair videos for y'all. Look, I'm not so bald head, y'all. Just until you lift up the sides, and then it's like, girl. <laughs> but um, yeah, thank you guys for watching my video. Hope I kept you guys entertained, and I hope I helped someone uh, with something new that they can try on their hair. Like I said, you guys let me know down in the comment section below if you have used these products, or if you are um, just now about to use these products due to my video. Y'all let me know, but thank you guys for watching. Bye.